Hey guys, welcome back, and today I'm going to share with you how to replace screen in Kind Master so you can make your videos better with effects like this. I did the same tutorial a couple of days ago, but on Final Cut Pro, a couple of people asked me to do it on Kind Master, so that's why I'm doing it. And before you watch the best YouTube video on Earth, let me give you the two shoutouts. So the notification shout-out goes to Path Shocker. Thank you so much for being first in my last video and shout out to you. And the everyday fan shout-out goes to Far Cry 5 Attackers Games. Thank you so much for being supportive on my channel and shout out to you. Now let's jump to, into this insanely awesome video. First you open Kind Master. And we're gonna start by doing it when you have green screen already. This is the easier method, then we're gonna go to the second one. Then we're gonna make a new project, then click 16 to 9. So now we're gonna click media. Now we're gonna click all, and we're gonna find the green screen clip. For example, this one, and then click check mark. Then click layer, then media, and then find your clip. Now make it smaller so it approximately fits that green screen. This should be good, but if you're not sure, you can click alpha opacity and then reduce the opacity of your clip. I think this is approximately good. And then click check mark. Now go to layer again, click media, and actually get the same green screen clip. Put it to full size again, like this, and then click chroma key. Then click enable, and there you go, now you're on the screen. Obviously adjust it a little bit, and then click check mark. And now I'm gonna export it, but and since it doesn't have animation, I'm gonna show you how to do it. Okay, now this is done. So we pretty much can close this project, open the new project, then click media, then click all, and then click check mark. And you can animate this two different ways. I'm gonna show you pen and zoom way and then the second way. So click pen and zoom, and you have the start position and end position. The start position we're gonna leave the same obviously, but click the end position and we're gonna resize it like that. Then click check mark. And now when you play it, it's gonna gradually move together. Like, just like that. Now I'm gonna show you a second way to animate it even better. So same thing, we're starting from a new project, so we click media, all. Obviously we have the same clip again. And now we can click these three dots on the left, and then click duplicate as layer. Now what happened now, you have two layers of the same video. Obviously resize it to full size. And then what you do, you go to the beginning of the timeline, click this circle with the key, and then under animation, click the circle of the plus sign, and then that cr created a keyframe. Move a little bit into a timeline, resize and reposition the clip. So for example, we're gonna go to the left first. And as you can see on the bottom, the other keyframe was created. So we're gonna move in the timeline for a little bit again, and then we're gonna manually add another keyframe. So that way it doesn't move between these two points. And then we go two or three seconds into the timeline, and then we put it totally a different direction. You see now another keyframe was created, because this way it gives you more control, and you can move in any specific way you want. See, when you play it, it's moving nicely now. Today I'm gonna share with you how to replace screen in Kind Masters. And of course, normally you would export it. Now I'm gonna show you if there's no actual green screen. So same thing, new project 16 and nine, media, all, Get the screen clip, but not your video, obviously. So there's some people here and we have a screen. Now we choose layer, then media, and then all. Then choose the clip, obviously my clip. And then adjust it so it appro approximately fits the screen. Then of course you can move it to the beginning of the timeline again. And then click cropping. And then crop your video until it fits on the screen. Just like that. Then you can export it, and then you can use the same method that I showed you before to animate it. If you want to see other really cool effects on Kind Master, make sure to click one of these two videos. They're really easy to do, but they make cool effects. Thank you so much for watching, make sure to subscribe because I post videos like these every single week, and I'll see you next time. Bye guys!